That's why, ladies and gentlemen, training uh, LMD ROI has to be business metrics, business objectives. Bus you know, it has to solve business challenges. If that means that you have to partner with other functions, other groups to achieve that business objective, so be it. So then you have to use your influencers to talk to HR, talk to other line functions, bring them on board, and then work with them to Otherwise, you'll never be able to achieve. Um, so today, uh, we started. When we started this initiative, we had 4% of our accounts, 4% of our businesses, uh, you know, the service lines, had zero effect. That doesn't mean they were performing badly. That does not mean 96% of the businesses were performing badly. They were doing well. They were almost close to 99% accuracy or 98%. But the leader was very clear that he wanted zero data. He did not want a single data. And then and he used to get a report, the number of defects, you know, on, on a given day. So he used to get a report. The quality um, head used to publish that report. And the objective was zero data. So today from 4% of our business, we should have read zero data. Because this is a really uh, very, very uh, ambitious, aspirational goal. We have moved the middle from 4% to 57%. 57% of the business today are zero defect. Our goal is in the next two quarters, we should achieve 100%. The entire operation, the digital operations and platforms that I support from a training perspective. That's an ambitious uh, goal that I have taken up. I am working very closely with uh, all the functions in our So we are almost to the end of this session. Uh, quick time check. I know that I have time. Getting close to the for the time perspective. So, how do you really align and then be with the partners? What are the key questions that you ask? How do how can LND gather support and sponsorship to senior managers so that LND is regarded as a key to drive the business? What we need to do to get sponsorship, gather support. The business leaders will listen to you only when you talk business. Only when you talk to them about in terms of revenues, cost reduction, CSAT, employee um, uh, satisfaction, ESAT, or when you talk about uh, making an impact on the top line, or the bottom line, or the facts, the problems, etc., they will listen to you. Otherwise, they're not going to listen to you. You just exist for them. But they're not really going to regard you as somebody who is really smart. How can LND ensure that you are delivering in alignment with the business? What I need to do is ensure that I'm not just I'm not just regarded as a strategy partner, but I'm also doing the right thing to uh, to deliver the strategy. What methodologies you can leverage in your LND that will make the company's strategy <coughs> So what methodologies are you going to bring in? What training interventions, coaching and mentoring interventions, what specific programs that you want to run? Remember, it's not just about training. It is about a series of interventions, actions, strategies to achieve that. In my case, one of my strategies was to go back and establish a partnership with other functions. It was not training. And I was not expected to do that. But I knew that if I have to achieve this strategy, I need to find, you know, get them on my side. How do you involve the managers pre post LND delivery in linking program projects? How do you really engage the mind? How do you engage your, your key stakeholders, your line managers, the people managers in the organization to actually partner with you in that process? Otherwise, you will announce programs, but managers will ensure that people don't come to programs. 
you will um, you will teach them the right behavior, but your managers do not teach them the right behavior. They do not teach them the right behavior. So you know, then you are you are, you are leaving these employees as a confused. So how do you really ensure that you involve managers in pre and post delivery, pre to understand and define the needs, post is to help you uh, measure the you know the ROI, coach the employees who have gone through the training. Yeah. Establish the right behavior, support them, and provide them the right ecosystem, platform, and environment and ambience so that they can demonstrate practice. So these are the questions that, as LMD, as LMD leaders, you must ask yourself as you think about the design. So with this, I will conclude here. Uh, we have probably about ten minutes or so. Uh, if you have any questions, I will try and answer. Since we're both